As we all know, mock drafts are hardly a guaranteed. It's more of an educated guess based on team needs, rumblings, etc. So when ESPN's Mel Kuyper Jr. has New England taking Duke quarterback Daniel Jones with the no. 32 overall pick in his latest mock draft, it should be taken with a grain of salt as anything can happen on draft day. In that spirit, the ESPN NFL draft expert was asked during a Tuesday conference call about the Patriots possibly going after some defensive tackles in this year's draft and in the first round that are day one ready. There are several if they got down that far that could be that type of player, Kuiper said, via WEEI.com. Jerry Tillery from Notre Dame, Draymond Jones from Ohio State, Gerald Willis out of Miami of Florida are all in that first round discussion. The interesting one is going to be Jeffrey Simmons from Mississippi State. You have a kid that has top 10 talent, some might argue top 5 talent that would be there because he had the off the field issue and then the ACL injury, so if you want to medically redshirt him maybe for a year, you're getting a top 5, top 10 talent with the final pick in the first round. He is a tremendous defensive tackle prospect, the New England Patriots are once again Super Bowl 53 champions. Take a second to sign up for our free Patriots newsletter. Asking this question really isn't out of bounds as it relates to the Patriots. Heading into this offseason, New England will see both Malcolm Brown and Danny Shelton hit free agency, which likely means they'll need to address that position at some point in the draft and or free agency. These names are intriguing especially that last one in Simmons. The 6'4", 300-pounder is quite the talent as he totaled 63 tackles, 18 tackles for a loss and two sacks last season at Mississippi State. He's a former five-star 247 sports recruit was ranked the 18th best overall prospect in the country coming out of high school. Given the Patriots' need at the position, it may be tricky for him to land in New England given that Simmons suffered a torn ACL last week as he was preparing for the Combine and the NFL Draft, which will likely keep him out all of his rookie year. That said, Simmons now comes with tremendous value as a top-tier player in college football will now be available for Bill Belichick at no. 32. The hoodie does have a history of using his first-round pick on defensive tackles as he did say in 2014 and 2015. That 2014 selection in Dominique Easley is also similar situation to what they could put themselves in with Simmons as Easley also was entering the league after tearing his ACL.